The System Insights feature in CrowdStrike Falcon Discover empowers security managers with comprehensive visibility into the system level components of endpoints, such as processor, memory, disk space utilization, drive encryption status, OS security settings, and other relevant information all in one place. When you navigate to the Discover module within the Falcon console, you will notice the new System Insights menu option, which will take us to the new tables with all system level information. But before I go there, let me take you to the new System Insights dashboard. It's a new option within the Asset dashboard. And now that I am here, you see this dashboard glowing with rich context on how the assets are configured and are performing. At this stage, you may wonder, why would a security manager operating the Falcon console be interested in this kind of system level data? There are three main applications. First, it's about getting to know what's out there, the core visibility use case. Just like software vulnerabilities, hardware too run into issues. You might have heard about the meltdown and spectre vulnerabilities that impacted many Intel processors. Very recently, there was a severe vulnerability on the Apple M1 chip. Gaining visibility is the first step in remediating those issues. The second application is for monitoring resource usage on endpoints. A security manager may want to install an application or perform a vulnerability scan and needs to determine if the systems have sufficient horsepower and capacity to handle these operations. These metrics are refreshed every 15 minutes, providing a close to real-time view of the system's performance. And lastly, the compliance use case. Many organizations have compliance requirements and security best practices to have all their data encrypted. So a user could come here and check how many assets have the drives encrypted versus not. A similar compliance analysis can be done for the Windows OS security settings to ensure certain security configurations are enabled on all the assets. Let me switch gears a bit now. If I click on these widgets, it will take me to the System Insights tables. Like on this widget, let's click here and see where it exactly takes us. Now we are in the new System Insights table, specifically under System Resources. We are now seeing a filtered list of assets with high memory use. But not just that, we see many more useful data here. The BIOS manufacturer and version numbers the processor settings, memory and disk space configuration and utilization. What you see here is the default table setting, but you don't need to be limited with it. You can use this column picker and add more relevant columns for your analysis. The same goes for this filter facet. The good news is all this data, both what you see here and the hidden ones, a total of over 70 asset attributes can be queried over REST APIs and can also be exported from here with this export button. The drive encryption table displays information about the encryption status of Windows and Mac OS devices. It indicates which devices have fully encrypted, partially encrypted or unencrypted drives using BitLocker for Windows and FileVault for Mac OS based devices. And lastly, the OS security table shows 10 Windows OS security settings from secure boot to memory protection to device guard status and so on. If some of these settings are critical for your security policy, then you may want to ensure they are always enabled. That's about System Insights. If you haven't tried it already, give it a shot. If you are new to Falcon Discover, then visit CrowdStrike.com to learn more. Thank you.